good morning. So today I got up out of bed at around 7.30. I got changed, I put on my makeup, so I put on my contacts. Um, I tidied my bed a little bit. Because I'm on my Easter break, that means I have two weeks to do a lot of revision before I go back to school before my exams. It's been requested by you guys that I film one of my days where I do some studying and some revision so you can study along with me or just see my daily routine as a student. So once I'd had my breakfast, which was just my usual fruit and yogurt, I then brushed my teeth and left the house. I left the house about 9am to go and walk my dog. I went to go meet my friend Casey, who is currently dog sitting for her friend, and she has the most adorable little sausage dog called Marley. To begin with, Marley was quite a cautious, scared dog. After all, she's only four months old, she's a puppy. Um, and Dim Sum is quite, um, she's quite a playful dog, I'd call her. But they got on, which was really nice, and I was just chucking stones for Dim Sum. This is her favorite game to play while she's on the beach. On the beach, she doesn't really retrieve balls so I just use stones because I have an abundant supply of them. So Casey and I were together for about an hour and a half. I got home at about 10.30. Before I said goodbye to Casey she gave me these huge pieces of paper. The one I'm currently using is the size of 16 A4 pieces of paper all stuck together. If you've watched any of my study videos you know I'm a huge fan of mind maps and big colourful things. So once I'd got home I laid out all the paper. I picked the one which I wanted and I've started doing some of my geography revision. If you do geography A level you know that you get a pre-release about eight weeks beforehand. This was let out a little bit early and it's about the development gap in Costa Rica, Nicaragua and Panama. Because I need to know the resource booklet inside out um, and some extra stuff I've decided to all stick it onto one big piece of paper and then do loads of annotations and print off some photos to make it nice and visual. On a normal school day I try to aim to do at least three hours of study if possible but during the Easter holidays it's pretty much just revision all day. I'm making regular trips down to the kitchen whilst doing this and I've pretty much eaten anything that's edible in my kitchen. I'm gonna take a quick break from revision. Poming and I are gonna quickly pop down to the shops. To go and pick up some stuff at a shop that's closing down. But before we attach a GoPro to my dog and see if that works... I received some things in the post and I got this letter from a girl called Sarah Fernandez um, and she lives in Alaska in Dutch Harbour, an unknown island. I've just read this letter and my sister was watching me and it's the sweetest thing I've ever received. She even went as far as putting in a return address envelope so I'll be writing back to her perhaps today later on. Um, I also got a My Waitrose card and my sister's birthday present arrived in the post. So, crazy day. All these packages. Mm -hmm. 
This evening is actually my friend's 18th birthday party. I love me. <laughs> my friends have arrived and we are now gonna head off to the party. So, adios. And that's just been an average day in my life. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for weekly videos every Thursday and I'll see you next week. Have a nice day. Bye.